sets her frigid <laughs> cold in the Northeast. Yeah, if you saw the Macy's Day Parade today, it was yeah. wow, it was cold. Yeah. In fact, the coldest in about 100 years and temperatures tonight getting even colder. Current temperature 20 right now in New York City, 16 in Boston. 10 in Albany, 9 in Portland, going to be in the low teens tonight. Look at the wind chills. Oh, yeah. This is right now here in South Florida is why we suffer through the heat because you look up here and you say, mm, no thanks. Look at the highs today. They were in the low 80s. Normal highs 81, so pretty close to the normal for this time of year. And this evening, a pretty nice evening out there. We've got some lightning off to our south and east. 72 in Miami, 73 Fort Lauderdale, Hollywood, 77 in Key West. Four on the stick and scale. Humidity's come up a bit tonight. Wind southeast at six. You may even see some patchy fog. Look at the radar. Big, big showers and thunderstorms marching into the Bahamas tonight. Uh, this is the activity that developed just to our east. Put on quite the lighting show. One little shower kind of worked its way into Coral Gables, Coconut Grove, and now is dying down near Miami Springs and MIA. Another band of showers has come up out of the Straits, now headed towards the lower and middle keys there from about Key West to Marathon. Could see some rain and some gusty winds over the next hour. Temperatures, they are warm in the south, 60s and 50s in the north. Going to be in the 40s there for overnight lows tonight, where fall really is in effect there. And the bigger picture showing a storm system developing off the east coast of Florida. Also, a low pressure area in the western Gulf that we're going to keep an eye on because that is going to impact our Saturday just a little bit. For the time being, the moisture for the spotty showers we saw today moves on out. Some slightly drier air comes in. Still a chance of a shower tomorrow afternoon, but a pretty low chance. And then here comes this disturbance, a weather disturbance with a blob of moisture arriving on Saturday. Clouds increase, showers move in. And then by Sunday, the showers move out and the clouds decrease. So kind of a quick moving disturbance coming right in the middle of the weekend. Temperatures across the country once again, pretty chilly in the northeast, the southeast cool, but not cold. The plains are warm in the west. It's been snowing in the Rockies. Many of the ski resorts are open. The west coast finally getting some much needed rain. Here's our forecast for tonight. Looking pretty good. Still a spotty shower can't be ruled out, especially over the lower and middle keys. A low temperature near 68 degrees. Tomorrow look for pleasant sunshine and some stray showers in the afternoon. High temperature near 81. For boaters, winds out of the northeast to east, averaging 10 knots, one to three foot seas, a light chop on the bays, and then taking us through the rest of the weekend to the weekend. Pretty good day tomorrow. Breeze and increasing chance for showers later in the day on Saturday, and then moving out Sunday. And maybe a cold front coming down in the middle of next week. We'll keep our eyes on that. Thanks.